Oh. <laughs> Just a joke. I'm actually fit as hell. Right. Um, so I keep up with uh, little Timmy's social life and his academic life. And he's got a little spelling bee coming up. A bit of the ABCs of life. Um, so I'm going to be teaching him a few tricks and sort of lessons that I've learned about spelling along the way through life. Uh, right, Timmy, look, luckily for you, before I majored in numbers, I majored in words. And they were calling me the word nerd back then. So this little spelling bee is not going to be a problem, okay? I'm actually a linguinus. So don't have to worry about your little spelling bee, all right? Do you mean linguini? What's linguini? The pasta? What are you talking about pasta for? We're talking about words. Me. We're in trouble. Bit of a challenge, but that's something that teachers encounter, challenges. Um, and I am a teacher, despite what those bloody comments have been saying. Um, so I'm just going to have to figure out how to get this through in pasta language. That's all Timmy wants to really talk about now. I thought it was Xbox. Changed. I've got it. Shuffling. Well, since I've figured out that he's got a pasta addiction, I thought we'll, we'll just put it on his terms, let him learn with pasta. That's what it's all about. So, um, obviously I've got this one. I got this one here. Um, bit of interactive learning for Timmy to get involved in. He loves this sort of stuff. Um, so I've got him to spell pasta. Obviously that's written here. Penne. Regate. They misspelled pasta on the packet. He hasn't got it yet. Oh, boy genius over here. Look at that. P-A-S-T-A. -S That's right. I think. I checked. I looked it up. Um, just to double check. They're always changing words. <laughs> How do you spell bold nose? Timmy, what did I say about questions, mate? Wait till the end of class. Not till the end, that's right. So, maybe later, at the end of the lesson. All right, that's actually all the time we've got, Timmy. Um, let's scoot that pasta up, get that water on, and make your mummy some dinner. Darren, your word is bread. Jeez, I've got to say, when I was a kid, you know, no kids were this smart. There's bloody boy geniuses everywhere. L-M-N-O-P. Fantastic, thank you, Darren. Oh, if I can't get uh, Timmy's head out of a bloody bowl of pasta, like we're in big trouble, I've got to say. Wait, why is he eating bread? would also like to just give a big shout out and a thanks to everyone who's come along today. This is a um, community run event, huge, huge thing. And we'd just like everyone to remember that you're all winners here. Anyway, moving on to our next contestant. Next contestant. You're the next contestant. Name? Timmy. T I M M Y. Great. Thanks, Timmy. Your word is onomatopoeia. What? Onomatopoeia? You're making up bloody fake words now. What is this? So it wasn't legal back when I was in spelling bees last week. Are you sure? Uh, I think we have to use the ace in the hole here. Onomatopoeia. Yeah, um, Timmy. Bring it in, mate. What's this? Yeah, it still hasn't changed. On a matter of here. I'm back, everyone. How are we this evening? <laughs> I'll teach that one later. It's complicated. How are we, mate? Just going to be jumping in there. Okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how is everyone tonight? What are you doing? Hey? What are you doing? Oh, we just used our um, phone of best friend. No, no, we've used our phone of best friend slash mentor card. Um, so I'm just going to be jumping in here. You're familiar with the protocols, I assume? Phone of friend's not a thing here. Um, it is in Survivor, mate. I think you should have a watch of the TV for once. <laughs> 
Looks like he lives in a bloody box. Doesn't know what he's doing. <laughs> Oh, okay. Um, we'll just grab the word then and I'll get on to spelling for you. Alrighty. Sure. Um, onomatopoeia. Not that word, mate. The next one. We've used our phone a friend, best friend. Card. Imbecile. Hmm. He's, he gives out hard words, doesn't he? <laughs> Alright. Um, right, so imbecile, can you put that in a sentence? That's something you're allowed to do. Yep. If you get on stage for a spelling bee that you're not a part of, you are an imbecile. Huh. Might get you spell it out for me, mate. Security, okay, that's actually really easy. S E K double O. Oh my god. Right, so if any of you kiddly stinkers need any teaching, you just get your mums or dads to call me, alright? Hmm? They actually taught Timmy everything he knows. And I moved in with his mum. Non sexual, I know what you're thinking. <laughs> Pervert. Moved in with his mum. Non sexual. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. Alright, reset. I moved in with his mum. Won't do that to your parents though. Can't guarantee yours. <laughs> <sighs> the kid's fucking addicted to <laughs> Get a little bit of science if you're in the mood for a bit of Neutron's laws. Um, oh. <laughs> look, Livy. Oh, look, Livy. <laughs> what is you, small? <laughs> don't bite down to feed you, small. <laughs> Do you guys ever have weird platonic relationships, or is that just me? <laughs> <laughs> you met Timmy before, or I actually taught him everything he knows? He looks like me, don't you think? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, that'll do. 